ladies. <laughs> Thank you, Papa. He always opens my door for me. Oh, by the way, look who's back. All right, happy Saturday. We are out and about with the family. Mike's home for the weekend. So we're trying to figure out some breakfast. Also, I got my hair. I went for another round last night. She did a good job. I feel like this is the perfect song to describe what I'm feeling right now. Put my finger in it. I'm so excited for this. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna sit y'all down for a second. My black shirt is really setting off the white balance on this camera. Mike is home for the weekend. He took the kids into Target. I stayed in the car because, oh my God, this is the first moment in three weeks that I have like had no children with me. <laughs> I freaking love my baby. Oh, I can say, I can say the F word. I can say the B, I can say all the words and not have to worry about tiny ears. Um, I love my children, I genuinely, genuinely do, but I think whether it's children or dogs or eating the same thing for three weeks, like whatever it is, after a while you're just like, can a bitch get a break, please. They went inside, I'm taking this one moment like by myself, and that's the thing is Mike's only here for a couple of days before he leaves again. Um, so it's like, it's gonna be like family time, him spending time with the kids, I feel like a rogue hair, like a rogue. Okay, look, I'm not afraid to vote you off the island and if you would like to stay on my head and flourish, you're gonna get in my hair. We're all gonna be like living on top of each other for the next couple of days, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Um, but I, I know that like this is my only moment to have some time to myself. So they went inside, I'm here. I thought I would show you guys um, my hair. She did such a good job. I was telling, um, I actually went, my grandma went with me yesterday and she was like, ooh girl, J-Lo who? Um, no, I was telling my hairdresser that like, I feel like expensive with this hair. I mean, it was expensive, but like, I just feel like, I don't know. I don't know what I was so worried about. Um, I don't know what I was so worried about with like lightening it up because I've never, I've never gone and gotten like a proper, gotten my hair like properly lightened and properly done. She did such a, she did such a good job because it's not like so, it's just, it's like the right amount of ashy and it's still kind of like warming up, but it's just, it's perfect. It's perfect, it's exactly, ugh. can't even talk, it's exactly what I needed in my life. Look at this hair, guys. And we evened out the bangs, that was my thing with this last time, but obviously, like, my hair is super dark, and while I haven't, like, dyed it, um, like, dark, I had it for, like, almost a year, I think. It had been since the last time that I, like, dyed my hair. Um, like with anything, I just let it go and let it grow. <laughs> and it like, hell it did, it grew a lot in that time. Um, but there's still like from maybe here down, there's still a good amount that does have that dark dye in it. And even some of this bottom part still has, like it's still, I don't know how much of this is left from when I had like the crazy like colors like red and blue and was doing like the short ombre um, in my hair and so obviously you know you want to protect your hair and keep the integrity of your hair so that it's not like being hella damaged. Um, she did a really great job. I was saying, just telling my grandma, like, this is like the first time in like two or three years where like I feel like me <laughs> because my hair was jacked and it was chopped and it was never ever oh my god it was never supposed to be as short as it ended up being and like you know i just it's it's really hard to go from like an a-line shaved undercut short hair and like growing that out especially i at my it would have been done a long time ago but you know i'm definitely responsible for the fact that like i was i was i was bleaching and dying and like killing my hair um in the process so it took longer than it needed to and the past the really since i moved to san antonio i just like i stopped entirely i was like okay i'm tired of like looking like this and it's it maybe my hair is my security blanket maybe i feel like um well I don't know. I just love. I just. I love hair. I love. I love hair. I love good hair. I love big hair. I feel like it's just part of 
my personality. It's part of what makes me kind of feel like me, and um, I'm feeling it. So there is that. Just like, ah, girl time, girl chat, even if it is just with the camera. Yeah, I really, really like this. I hope you guys like my hair. What do y'all think? I feel like she did such a good job. I feel like she did such a good job. And the thing is, is it's still, you guys can see, it's still healthy. So I think we're going to live with this for a little while. Um, I'm not planning on going back for a while. I did my first round of like highlights two weeks ago. And then we did another round last night. So it definitely added some dimension and is a lot lighter and brighter. Um, and then I'll probably go back. I don't know. We'll see how I do with like the growing out routage phase. We'll see how that goes. Let's throw this guy. Michael's in town. He wants to keep me chubby. Woo! So this little cat was on our patio. It's been coming back like all week long. Aww, she's oh, she's Oh, Minerva, she's yeah. so <laughs> Minerva's like, this is my house. You do not belong here. Hi, kitty. It's okay. Hi. Hi. We're not keeping this cat. Are you sure? No, I'm positive. We cannot no, handle another it's cat. So sweet. <laughs> Plus all the hissing and fighting. At least let it eat. Hi, Hi Gato. Hi. Hi. No, we can't keep it. It has a collar. I know. I think goes upstairs, babe. I don't And he's making himself at home. Minerva. Look at her. She's so mad. She's so mad. Super dark in here right now. Mike and Joshua decided that they wanted pizza for dinner, so they went to go pick up pizza. I'm whispering because Alyssa is asleep. Something about having Mike at home, like my entire house just explodes. <laughs> but I'm not gonna complain about it. I'm not gonna complain about it. Today has been really fantastic, like just family. I feel like I've been doing so much to try and keep so busy the past three or four weeks. But are these cats still out here? So we put the little kitty back outside. And the last time that I came back here to check, to see, there were four cats on my patio. So <laughs> I didn't choose the crazy cat lady life. It chose me. It's so cold outside, I feel so bad. Minerva. Okay guys, don't judge my patio. This is my husband's job. He's just out there being cold. Oh my God, I feel so bad. Minerva, be nice to the kitty. Look at him. I mean, I'm sure he has an owner, right? Like he has to, he has a little I think it's just a flea collar, but he has a little collar on. He has to have, he has to have, he has to have an owner. But sorry, this is something that you guys haven't seen in the vlog. This little kitten has actually been coming like to my, like my back porch. Yeah, he's been coming and visiting for about a week now. <laughs> Literally every day, every time I open my, like every time I take a peek out back, he's back there. Um... I feel really guilty about like letting him have come in and have some food and then just putting him back outside but he's not my kitty and so I feel, I feel really bad about it. The other day when I was at Hobby Lobby I got this cute little um here let me flip y'all around. This cute little embroidery set for Alyssa. She wanted to learn how to do this so here I am trying to teach my five-year-old how to embroider. She's actually <laughs> doing a really cute job. We're working on this cat so, um, but instead of doing the cross stitch, she just wants to do the lines like that. So I actually, yeah, you're doing a great job. So I am just writing to make sure that I keep track of, hold on, honey, I'm going to put this here, writing so that I can know which ones that we've already done. Hold on, hold on. What lines? We've already done, so we've got one, hold on, two, three, three lines, two, three, right now you're working on your fourth line, let me see, one, two, so one, two, we're going to do this, one, two, three, 
four times? Four times. And pull it through, and then where are you gonna go from here? Mm, I don't know. You always go back, like that, okay? So you go back into that other one. Good job, right there. Then you can get a fresh touch, right? I also finished my blanket. By the way, sorry we moved in here because I need to get more light bulbs for my kitchen. I don't know if your last little bit here. I'm just already recording. So that's how it looks like. <laughs> what do you think? Perfect. You did a good job. You can be so. Finally, all done. Hold, no, don't hold it like that. I want to see the design. Good. You did a really good job, baby.